It's been a wonderful weekend. Fruitful weekend. I want to thank God Almighty for the grace given to us to have gone to reopen a branch of this ministry. In Akure on the state, Nigeria. I greet you all in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. My name is Timothy Profitable and this is Blevoy. Today's episode is a very simple one. A squan opens in Akure, Edo State in Nigeria. Now, this is not a very big surprise for some of us who've been following the episodes and the sequence of our analytics in this channel. But I believe someone somewhere, it's a surprise, it's a, something to just explode about. But I believe if we had seen this according to the prophetic words of Prophet T.B. Joshua and prophetic words of Prophetess Evelyn Joshua, we will definitely know a lot of these kind of actions are still coming to have a lot of encounters, I mean, a lot of happenings in Squan generally. The global vision is glowing and glowing and becoming growing and bigger and bigger by day, by each day. Now, this branch is a very good thing. I want to give you just a clause of what happened uh, according to the appreciation prologue of Prophetess Evelyn in a service that it was one of the days that has just passed shortly past. Keep watching. Emmanuel. Emmanuel. God is with us. God is with us. God is with you. May he continue to be with you in the name of Jesus Christ. Good morning, church. Good morning, church. Good morning and win today. Win tomorrow. And win forever. Shall we put our hands together and clap for the Lord? Make a joyful sound to the God. Amen. Amen. Please do have your seat. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. It's been a wonderful weekend. Fruitful weekend. I want to thank God Almighty for the grace given to us to have gone to reopen a branch of this ministry. In Akure, on the state, Nigeria. I want to use this opportunity to say thank you to our partners, friends of the ministry, to all who made the sacrifice to travel with us for the celebration. God bless you all. God bless you. And to those of us who are watching at home, we thank you for your prayers. God bless you too. Amen. Amen. Yes. God Almighty says in the book of Jeremiah 33 verse 3, say, call on me and I'll answer you. Call on me and I will answer you and show you great and unsearchable things you do not know. Call on me and I will answer you is an invitation to pray, to ask, seek, to find, and also to receive. Call on me and I will answer you. Call on me in faith and in truth, not in wavering. Because to waver is to doubt, 
to be afraid. In life, we have many reasons to be afraid. But we also have greater reasons not to be. Because Christ is on the throne. 